As you know, myself and Lord of Assassins have been playing Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League. There's an official Season 2 Meet Mrs. Freeze launch trailer. Mrs. Freeze? Who the heck is that? Here we are again. Me and you against the world. What a world it is. It took serious modifications to my body to survive in Brainiac's frozen wasteland. As for my mind... Dr. Frias always has a plan, but I couldn't plan our way out of this one. Time and time again, I refused to join Amanda Waller and her task force. All the evidence suggested my involvement would do little to save the world, but I could save our world. Eventually, the calls stopped coming, and we were alone. Until now, I received a communication from another Waller. Another dimension, another chance. This Waller seems different, more calculating. Her task force sounds marginally more competent. They've already begun a counterattack against Brainiac. But as always with Waller, there was a deal to be made. Her world's greatest scientific minds working on a cure for my assistance in recovering the Flash. Send a scientist to find a scientist. I see the logic. If her people can reach us, we'll prove their capabilities. And if they can't, it's still me and you against the world. Nora. So it's the same concept of Mr. Freeze with the same wife inside of a cryogenic chamber just with a female... Freeze? Why'd they change the gender of Mr. Freeze? Why did it matter? Well, that's, uh, Mrs. Freeze the launch trailer. So, I, I mean, I don't have, like, the season pass or whatever, so I won't be playing this. But I am playing the base game. The base game seems okay right now. This is a weird take. Weird take. Just don't know why they did it. 